All right, guys. Welcome back to the garage. Uh, tonight we're going to be working on the new bike. This is not the same old Yamaha like from all you other subscribers remember. It does look very similar though. Uh, we're having a issue with the radio. That's just the main focus of tonight's video. Um, it does have an aftermarket radio. Um, and I believe the speakers are upgraded as well. Through Rockford Fosgate. There's two here, two there, and then two there. And when you're riding along, the radio is fine. Um, and then it'll just, it just powers off. It's blowing a fuse in the side panel down there in the fuse box. So we're going to take the front fairing off first to see if I can find a reason why it's doing that. Let me set you guys on a tripod and we'll take it apart. Let me show you what we can what we found so far first of all this is the inside of the fairing uh, on a 06 ultra glide uh, somebody has upgraded the speakers at least in the fairing because those are uh, rocker fosgate punch speakers uh, there's two of those uh, and they used an aftermarket radio which i don't know what was wrong with the other one uh I have a sticker there, Fathead Cycles, wherever that's from, not sure, but this, this piece here, and all of this is like an aftermarket uh, wiring harness that you can get, I guess this at one time plugged into the factory radio, as well as this part, so, and it did have this blue wire which is shrinked off. They had this thing, this plug here, taped into the remote, the blue plug there. I'm not sure what that was doing, but I took that out. And something else. Oh yeah, I plugged the antenna back in. The antenna wasn't plugged in. So now I got radio stations. That's, that's good. And they had a 20 amp fuse in the radio where it's supposed to be a 15 amp. So I replaced that and I replaced the fuse in the circuit in the fuse box and turned it on. And it plays for a few minutes and I wiggle all these wires um, and see if that works. I'm not sure exactly what this plug does, but I'm pretty sure somebody will tell me. Maybe to the CB part of it. Um, I know there's a, uh, this is the part for your uh, 
CB functions there, but it's not hooked to anything, so. So yeah, like I said, I jiggled all the wires and everything, and I don't see anything of what could be causing the fuse to blow, so I'm going to leave this unplugged, and I'm going to tape up and reorganize all this. This is a extension cable for the for like if you have, if you need a USB port right there which that's pretty handy I imagine you could stretch this back to the to the back if you ever needed something for the passenger but I don't use this so it's gonna be zip tied right there and we're gonna put all this back together and let you guys watch <laughs> see got the front fairing back on and everything and those screws I was taking off to take this front cover off you got to take these three uh, star bits they're t27s and there's one here on both sides and then one on both sides up in the center like I showed you I took these other three off on each side thinking that was what was holding it on these don't do anything they hold on the wind deflector if you have one of those so you can leave these six attached to the black inside fairing but yeah that's going to be it for this part i'm just going to clean up underneath this seat with a rag because it is super dirty before i put it back together so yeah hope you guys enjoy hope you guys enjoyed this first little fix on our new bike also i took before I get off of here, I think this is for the old uh, satellite radio, Sirius XM. I took it off of there too. I'm not sure exactly if this was a problem, but we took it off anyway. Yeah.